Hey, what is up guys? It is me, Flavio here, back with another Mafia City video. This is part 2 of the building guide. If you haven't checked out part 1 of this video, I'll leave a link to it down in the description below. You can go and check it out from there and come back to this video later on. So let's get right into the video. Let's start this video with the Invest Center. Upgrading the Invest Center will unlock more properties for you to invest in and will sometimes allow you to upgrade existing properties to higher levels. I would recommend upgrading this building only if doing so unlocks a property that you want to invest in. Next up is the Radar. Upgrading the Radar gives you more detailed spy reports and also more detailed info about incoming troops. Depending upon the amount of information you want about your opponent, you can choose whether you want to upgrade this building or not. The Diner. This building will increase your march size. It is a must to upgrade this building if you want to increase the power of your attacks. Having more troops per march not only increases the probability of you winning battles, but it also will decrease the amount of troops you lose in battles. So I would strongly recommend upgrading this building whenever you can. Let's move on to the vault. This building protects your resources. I would recommend upgrading this building only if you're getting attacked a lot as it will protect your resources if you get attacked when unbubbled. However, if you're in a strong clan that doesn't get attacked a lot, then you can ignore upgrading this building. Next up is the clan club. Apart from increasing your reinforcement capacity, upgrading the clan club will also increase the number of helps that you can get from your clanmates. And it will also increase the time reduced by each help. Again, depending upon the activity of your clan, you can choose whether to upgrade your clan club or not. Now let's talk about the resource production buildings. These buildings include the counterfeiter, the cargo hub, ammunition, and smelter. Upgrading these buildings will increase the amount of resources produced by them per hour and also their storage capacity. I would recommend upgrading these buildings only in your farm account instead of spending the time and resources for upgrading them on your main account. Let's take a look at the club now. Upgrading your clubs increases the amount of troops you can train at a time and they also increase your training speed. Depending upon your playstyle, you can choose whether to upgrade these buildings or not. And finally, the hospital. The hospital protects your troops from dying. If you get attacked or if you attack someone on a resource tile, then the troops you lose will get converted into wounded troops provided you have sufficient space in your hospital. I would recommend building 8 hospitals and maxing them out if you can so that you don't lose a lot of troops when you're attacked. So those were all the buildings in the game. I hope this video helped you guys learn something new. I'll be doing videos on more advanced topics soon, so make sure you subscribe for more of these Mafia City videos. Thanks for watching the video guys, and I'll see you guys in the next one.